Welcome back out to another one of our standout student interviews as we keep rolling along in the pregame show as Gabe Gentile, a junior here at Salada High School, taking some time to talk. And Gabe, first of all, junior year, how's it been going so far? Been going really good this year. Actually, I have a building trades class for three hours out of the day, which is really nice to just get out of the school and not worry about my core classes. We'll just roll right into uh, talking a little bit about the classes then, because that's a great one to talk about. What made you want to get into something that was so unique like that? Well, it's just something I can use like after school and like I've already got job offers at DSI, which is really cool to me. So it's just something I can use afterwards, which is nice. When you think about uh, this type of class versus another type of class, what would you tell somebody about getting into it? Like what's uh, what, what would prepare them better for going into something like a building trades? Just make sure you have like good work ethic and you have listening skills because he just tells you one time and you have to do what he says. Talk a little bit about your favorite parts of the job. What's uh, What are some of the things that you've really enjoyed working on the most? I've enjoyed doing like framing on the house because it's just quick. You can slap it together and get it all up and just working with like other students is really nice. We'll talk a little bit more about it because this might ties into what you might want to do after school. But before we get into that, any other classes or, or subjects that really get you excited or, or you look forward to going into? Yeah, I get excited for going into uh, American history with Mr. Griffin just because he's like a really good teacher and gets to know all of us pretty well. So it's just a good class. You said that's really what you look for in a teacher is, is somebody that takes the time to figure out how you learn best. What does that change about the relationship with you and that teacher? You just get along better. Some teachers don't know like some personal things about you so they can like they can't avoid that. But like Mr. Griffin and like Fred Maxwell. They're really good teachers because they know you more personally. There's so much stuff to do around the school. You don't necessarily do a whole lot of the club and group stuff, though, but you keep yourself busy and active. What's your favorite stuff to do around Salida and just around the area? My favorite thing to do after school is just go ride my bike at the skate park with all my friends and just spend most of my weekends doing that, too. Talk a little bit about the uh, the. the the basic life growing up here in Salida. What what are some of the things that you pick up from just just living in a mountain town that you think you might not get if you were living in a city? Well, we know a lot about like the river and fishing and hunting and all that because it's just minutes away. And in like a city, you can't really learn that because it's more of a task to leave and just go out outdoors, I guess. Talk a little bit about coming or looking ahead to the future. We said the the building trades class ties into that. You said a trade school might be what's next for you. How uh, how how far would you like that to take you? And 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 what excites you the most about the the next steps of learning and really diving into a trade? I would just like to get into that because it's a good career to go into, and you can just you can keep moving up and making more money and just not be stuck at like an office job. When you talk about uh, that, still a ways to get to go. You have a senior year left to go. Anything you're looking forward to the most about your senior year? Honestly, just like another building trades class <laughs> and just getting ready to get out of school. Just looking forward to the life after, I guess. Bring it back to the school and and look back to your freshman year. What would you go back and tell yourself as a freshman or tell other kids around you if you came in and, and uh, had the chance to give them some advice? I just tell everybody to try to be cool with everybody and just make friends because I've seen a lot of freshmen struggling with that this year, and it makes their year a lot worse. And finally, what uh, what what are you going to miss the most about Salida if you ever move away from here or when you move away from here? What, uh, what are some of the things that you enjoy the most? Just a small community and just like knowing everybody and being friends with everybody and just being able to go outdoors whenever you'd like. Gabe, it's been awesome getting to know you a little bit better and good luck as you keep going through the junior year and moving on towards the, uh, the years after high school. Thank you.